You become a teacher to try to make a difference. Make school special for your kids. I think that's the biggest thing that I try to do, make it special. So it was my first year teaching. I, I saw that the kids were not very interested and I asked my class, what can I do to make your school better? One little girl said, well, Mr. Dabba, why don't we make a school garden like my old school? And so I'm thinking about all the reasons why we can't do that. And I said, how are we gonna pay for this? Who's, who's gonna take care of it? And then I had to just say, Mr. Dabba, those are just details. And so I said, okay, I like the way you think. I went to the principal, Mrs. Ward, and I said, Mrs. Ward, you know, I would like to build a garden. And she said, Mr. Diablo, how are you gonna pay for this? And who's gonna take care of it? And I told Ms. Ward, Ms. Ward, those are just details. And a few months later, we got the okay. We built that first garden and we haven't stopped since. For 18 years later, we have 13 gardens. Just being out here, like the fresh air and stuff, and learning about the plants that we grow, just smells like you would be like in the rainforest. I enjoyed these gardens a lot, but you can actually taste what you're reading about and actually just pull it off the tree and it's more interactive than it is just reading inside the classroom. I got to eat a carrot pulled out of the dirt, like we didn't even know there was one, and I was like, hey, what's this? And then Mrs. D, I was like, oh, that's a carrot. And so I took it home, I washed it, and I ate it. The ones at the store, they're like not as sweet as the ones pulled out from the ground. Just being out here, you feel more comfortable. And if I'm doing the lesson here, they're listening more than if I'm just doing it from a lecture in class. I want them to enjoy learning. It's not something that you have to do, it's something that you get to do. Science is everywhere. And when you actually are able to experience it this way with hands-on projects and lessons, they understand that. Like the ability to be able to plant things and see them grow. Like to be able to like just see this entire place materialize around you just at one time. I think it's really cool. That's another thing that the garden does. It allows them to see the world differently, it allows them to see themselves differently, and they're more positive because of it. We become a family. It becomes something real. And that's what I want to be for, for the kids that I serve.